On March 14th, Honduras will hold primary elections. Three political parties will choose their official candidates to participate in the November 2021 general elections, as well as the leaders of their political institutions. Fully managed elections in 2017 led to distrust in the electoral system. Following 2019 reforms, these will be the first primary elections in Honduras under a new two-part electoral entity, the National Electoral Council and the Electoral Justice Tribunal. However, political parties continue to discuss the need for new and deeper electoral reforms. Damage caused by hurricanes Iota and Eta in November 2020 created additional challenges. The National Electoral Council has had to relocate voting centers because damage could not be repaired in time for the March 14th primaries, potentially causing additional confusion for voters if not communicated effectively. In light of the more than 170,000 COVID-19 cases in Honduras, prevention measures against the spread of the virus are essential in these elections. Biosecurity protocols, such as those to control the maximum occupancy of polling locations, as well as ventilation and hygiene facilities requirements, are critical to prioritizing the health of Hondurans in the voting centers. These measures are crucial to facilitate participatory, transparent, and equitable primary elections and build trust ahead of the general elections.